Hi everybody, this is Miss Melanie. I'm here with my buddies and we're going to talk to you about the craft that we're going to make today. It goes along with our lesson this week, which is about how to be joyful or be happy even when there's trouble. So, you know, right now with all the sickness that's going around, uh, we kind of have to stay home and it might make you sad that you can't go to school and maybe our hearts feel like this. See how that heart is all sad? Maybe, you know, because we can't go see Grandma and Grandpa or go on vacation. But did you know that if we have Jesus in our heart, it can look like that. See how pretty that is? It looks happy, doesn't it? Even when there's trouble, we can still be happy if we have Jesus in our heart. So we're going to show you how to make this craft today. First thing we're going to do is we're going to show you what we're going to need. So you're going to need a coffee filter, like that. If nobody in your house drinks coffee, you can use a paper towel. Paper towel will work too. Then we're going to need some markers, a piece of construction paper, some scissors, some scissors, a glue stick, and a bottle of water to spray, or if you don't have a little spray bottle like that, just so that you can get your napkin or your paper towel or your coffee filter wet. That's all we need. So the first thing you want to do is you want to color your coffee filter so that it looks like this one that we've already colored. See that one that we've already colored? There you go. See, it's all pretty. So then the, after you get it all colored, you're going to put it on a napkin or on a paper towel, and you're going to take the spray bottle, and you're going to spray it so that it's all wet. So he's going to spray that coffee filter and get it all wet. going to get it all the way wet. And when you get it all wet, then you're going to let it dry. Then you're going to take your, while it's drying, you're going to take your construction paper and fold it in half like that. And you're going to cut out a heart. So that's what my buddy's doing right now. I'm going to try and get a better picture of him cutting out that part. So you're going to see a really cool thing when he gets that all cut out around there. It's going to be a big picture of an empty heart. See when he gets it all the way cut around there. There he goes. Almost got it. Now he's going to open up his paper and he's got a big empty heart there. So then you're going to take your picture there, your coffee filter that you got wet after it dries and you're going to put it on it. Take your glue stick And you're going to glue it on the back of your picture with your big empty heart. You're going to put some glue around there just like that. That's good. You're going to get it all the way around. He's doing a really good job, my buddy is. Getting all that glue all the way around. What are you guys doing for the 4th of July? Um, we're throwing a party. You're throwing a party. What else? Is anybody going to uh, see some fireworks or anything? Yeah, we saw fireworks when we were when we were camping. You did? That's fun. So you see what my buddy did? He just glued his pretty paper on the back, and then when you pick it up, look at that. Look at that happy heart. So that shows us that, like I said, even when we're sad or even when we don't get to do things we want to do or there might be something bad going on, if we have Jesus in our heart we can still be happy. Well, I want to tell you happy 4th of July and happy birthday to America. That's what 4th of July is. And we can also be thankful and thank God that we live in the best country on the earth, that we are free, that we can go to church anytime we want to, that we can pray and talk about Jesus anytime we want to. Did you know that there are people who live in some other countries? They aren't allowed to do that. They aren't allowed to go to church. They're not allowed to talk about Jesus. But we can, because like I said, we live in the best country on the earth. We thank God that we were born here. All right, I want you to have a good weekend. Can't wait to see you. It's not going to be long now. Love you so much. Bye-bye.